Okay, here we go. We've got this 2015 BMW 328i with 66,000 miles. This thing is beautiful, I must say. Uh, red looks awesome on these cars. So we're gonna start from the driver's side and work our way around. Front quarter panel on the driver's side looks phenomenal. You'll notice that there's a side camera there. This thing, so it was a base model, but it was extremely well optioned out. So it's basically a fully loaded model without the uh, package nomenclature, but it has all the cool stuff. So we'll get to that in here in a minute. Um, nice looking wheels. They've got these caliper covers, which if you don't like them, they can come right off. Um, but I guess they were trying to go with the, you know, red flow of things. Coming around the front, you've got this really, really tastefully done splitter. Uh, I love this because it's not all crappy and banged up and, you know, cheap carbon fiber. It just looks really nice with this car. Um, it fits with the red and black theme they've got going on. You've got the black kidney grills as well. But again, bumper looks really nice too. Um, you know, no dings or scratches. Typical small, tiny little rock chips, you know, that you'll see for a used car of this age. Um, you know, on the hood and stuff. But honestly, it's been really well taken care of, it looks like. So, coming around to the passenger side. Again, you've got the camera there, which gives you the 360 view. Um, nice looking wheel and tire there. No curb rash. Coming along the quarter panel. That looks great. And transitioning to the front door here. Passenger side, we've got these cool carbon fiber mirror caps, really tastefully done as well. Um, and as we go along the side here, so the door panel looks great. There's no dents, uh, there's no dings, just a little wet being outside, but. Um, and then they also added the uh, subtle black side skirt here to complement the front splitter. Um, very nicely done. And then we transition to the rear wheel here. Looks great there. Rear quarter looks awesome. In the back, they continued on with the black theme um, with these little uh, gloss black, I don't know what they're called, Kennards or something like that. Anyway, um, they kind of just continue the flow of the look and it's actually really cool looking. Coming around the backside, super clean of course. Um, you know, no real issues to speak of back here, all looks great. You've got the black exhaust tips, which is a really nice little touch. And then, of course, the to complete it, the black lip along the uh, back here, which is in really great shape as well. Looks like they did uh, carbon fiber on the antenna um, shark fin here to kind of complement the mirrors. And then we're going to come back around this rear quarter. That looks great. Back door, back wheel, all that stuff look really nice. This car is in beautiful shape. So we're going to do an interior peek now. Um, you've got the really neat BMW projector logos here from the bottom and then as we get into the inside so uh, we've got you know the lane tracking assist the uh, collision warning all that kind of stuff uh, built in with this one with the options um, it's got the partially digital dash there's the mileage it's got the silver trim along with it um, you know, parking sensors, camera view, sport mode, eco mode, traction control, um, and then you've got the upgraded screen. Really nice view there, high def screen. Seats are in great shape. It's even got the accent lighting package. That is so cool. Along the doors there, LED lights, front and rear, just to give it a little extra class. And then we'll do a quick view of the back seat. Gotta unlock the car first. And back seat. Again, they've got the logos there. Back seat looks amazing, almost like it was hardly ever sat in. So, all in all, this thing is amazing. Definitely one of uh, the nicest 328s I've seen come through here.